What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today we're going to discuss more on the progress of the Black Spindle aka the Whisper of the Worm. Also talking about the catalyst, how it's obtained and what you need to do to complete it. But before we get into that guys, every month I'm giving away a fully customizable controller to be with a chance of winning it. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. More details at the end of the video people. Okay, so we all know how to get the Black Spindle or the Whisper of the Worm. You need to trigger the Taken Blight public event within the Lost Oasis area on IO. Upon doing this, a Taken HVT will spawn in. He can be in numerous locations in this area, so go ahead and search him down. You don't actually have to do the public event, just trigger it. Upon finding this Taken HVT and killing him, a portal will spawn in. Simply go into the portal and get to work. I will have a full walkthrough guide on my channel tomorrow, so stay tuned for that if you are struggling. So upon completing the mission, you are rewarded the Whisper the Worm aka Black Spindle Exotic Sniper Rifle. But it doesn't end there guys, upon completing this hidden IO mission, the mission then becomes available at a 400 power level heroic version for you to do again, selectable from IO's map. Completing this guys rewards you the catalyst for this weapon. Now to complete the catalyst we see it states obtain blighted essence from the whisper heroic to upgrade this weapon. What you need to do is go back into the heroic version of the whisper mission and run it a few times killing bosses within the mission. Upon doing that you will complete this catalyst challenge and the masterwork version gives you box breathing. This basically increases range and precision damage after a couple of seconds of ADS, much like the Darcy. Move over Darcy, there's a new bad boy in town, so it seems. Also great to note, the white nail exotic perk on this bad boy if you land three precision shots. It doesn't pull from the magazine, so basically unlimited headshots. Damn, beware bosses, things just went up a few levels. Jesus. Another thing to mention guys, when you actually obtain this weapon, it seems as though Eververse offers you a special bundle for the weapon, only available for those who have the actual Black Spindle, aka Whisper the Worm. Now there is a couple of packages she has for sale. The first one's called Between Breaths. This is a bundle. And you can see the ornament you get on screen now looks incredible. But it costs that real life dollar dollar people, so be warned. There's also a second ornament called the Bound Hammer. And this looks great too, it really does. I just don't think I can part with more money on this game. Not until the four second anyway. The crazy thing I found about this is though, Bungie didn't even wait to make money off this one. As soon as it was found, yes, come to Eververse, spend some money on this pretty sniper, make it look even prettier. I can see the dollar signs in their eyes from here, other side of the planet. But yeah guys, today has been a crazy day for sure. These are the things we love about Destiny, we need more of these hidden secrets. Hopefully days like these come much more often with the Forsaken DLC this September. Absolutely amazing. But on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. Massive thanks to Legitimate TB for the footage of the weapon, looking great. And before we end guys, to be with a chance for winning my monthly controller giveaway for Xbox or PlayStation sent anywhere in the world, drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below and follow the Gleam link within the video description. Fast, simple and legit. Good luck everybody. On that note guys, I am out. Hope you enjoyed the video and hopefully I'll see you on the next one. Get it right.